Good morning, IHS. My name is Danny, and this is a little red in the morning. Today is Friday, June 5th, day 5. For lunch today, there is mac and cheese. Anyone interested in joining the crew team next year, especially girls interested in coxing next season, see Hallie Molina for info about signing up. Would you like to make an impact on government decisions in the city of Ithaca? If so, then come join Ithaca Youth Council. They meet weekly on Wednesdays from 6 to 7.30 p.m. The Youth Council is a great way to get governmental experience as early as high school. Hey, 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 IHS. From now until the end of the school year, the Green Team will be collecting your gently used school supplies from this year. They accept binders, folders, pencil cases, and various other items. If you're ready to chuck your junk, Drop it off in one of the labeled boxes in the cafeteria, age courtyard, library, activities, or the main office. Because one man's trash is another man's treasure. Now here's Cameron with the weather. Thank you, Danny. Today it did start out quite sunny, but as we get later on in the evening, the clouds will develop and there is likely to be some thunderstorms. Tomorrow... We're expecting clear skies, which is uh, great for prom for all the seniors and anyone who may be attending with them. And then Sunday, we're back to more storms. It'll carry on until Monday. And now here's James with some news. Thank you, Mr. Burbank. Today's word of the day is senioritis. And in the news, a man in Ithaca pleads guilty to robbing a smoke shop. On Wednesday morning, smoke, smoke shop owner Julianne Lees was robbed by a man who threatened to kill her if she didn't give him all of the money. The next day, they arrested the man, Alan Richards, for third-degree robbery. His bail is $5,000. Now here's Sako with some sports. Thanks, James. The girls' swimming team enjoyed a very successful season this year as they placed fourth as a team in the state championships. Ayla Bonnell, Hannah Bollinger, and Cecile Browning all won their respective individual sectional championships. With a team that has members ranging from 7th grade to seniors, sometimes it's hard to expect a great season. But our team certainly proved everyone wrong going undefeated with a 7-0 regular season. Now back to you, Danny. This is a little ride in the morning saying goodbye.